So I'm live here with Coach Towers. Coach Towers, exciting win here for you tonight. Came down to uh, making your free throws in the end. You kind of had a rough start with your free throws, but uh, senior Dexter Walker and uh, junior Ray Harris seemed to make them in the end. They did. Those guys stepped up. Uh, that senior leadership from Dexter was huge. Um, you know, we got off to a slow start tonight. Like I've, I've talked to you before, we're about a weekend with our whole team, and um, I was worried about that with our shooting, but they got it out in the first half, and I was really proud of them. St. Charles West is a really good team, well coached. Um, Jeremy Jackson does a great job with them too, and I knew they would be. And uh, they came back. Percy got hot. We, we, you know, contained him for a little bit, but he's really good. And um, you know, and we got cold. And that, you know, that happens. There's going to be streaks in games. I thought we sustained their run, and. Um, our guys then, you know, caught their second win, did a great job of, of taking care of the, the basketball and making their shots, like you said. Now, I know with the final seconds, like it's, I can kind of see the wheels turning in your head. You had Drew Hare on the sideline throwing it in. Looks like one of those little screens out in football. He found his favorite receiver, Harris, there. Uh, yeah, those guys connected many times in football, and Drew's so smart. Uh, a lot of our guys are on the team, but Drew's a really smart ball player. Um, I would love to have him on the line, too, but I want the ball in his hands. I know he's going to make good choices. Like I said, I watched it in football the whole time. So, Well, thank you for your time here with the Jaguars winning 43-41 to over St. Charles West. Go down and talk to your team, Suchin Prubo.